I am uh, Dr. Ayub Rahman posting. So uh, my title is Know What to Escape. Our patient Mr. X, 60 years old, hypertensive diabetic smoker, presented with exertional chest pain for six months. His EKG showed STT change in inferior leads and echo was not remarkable. So uh, when we plan for the angiogram, we see there is a critical lesion in the distal L6. LED proximal has got minor plaque. This is the, uh, but RCA also has got critical lesion in the distal segment. So accordingly, we labeled it as a double vessel disease and plan for standing to the LCX and RCA. So we proceed with the RCA. Say we uh, done it very smoothly with a 2.12 pre-dilation balloon and standard with a 3 into 30 resolute integrity with a series factory result that is TME3 flow in the RCA. Next, we proceed to the LCX. Initially, we took a 2.25 balloon and pre-dilated the lesion very good. Uh, but when we introduce the stent, uh, we are facing difficulties just at the entry point. So we again uh, pull this stent and took another wire that is body wire and again balloon it sequentially with the help of the body wire. Then again try to introduce the stent. But in that case uh, position we found that already the stent has been dislodged from the balloon, stent balloon. So it's a very terrible situation and just close to the aortic ostium. So uh, see the stand is hanging in the wire, just over the wire and we just uh, tried initially with the, uh, to put it on the balloon but we failed. Then we took another wire and just we crossed the stand in the second slide we can see that with the help of second wire we crossed the stand and we pull it towards the catheter. The point is that, that the stand distal segment was distorted in such a way that only first part of the segment was intruding in the catheter, but distal segments was not introducing in the catheter. So we decided to pull it towards the radial end with the help of a 1.5 balloon. We took a 1.5 balloon and entered in the stent and just slightly in inflated and pull it towards our radial sheath. See, uh, we uh, carefully drag it towards the sheath, but uh, when we close to the sheath, we tried to trap it by slight rotation twisting the uh, wire, two wire, one is inside the balloon and one is another side of the stand. So it, we tried and twist, already we will twist it, but even after twisting, that uh, stand was not entering in the sheet or catheter. We tried several times. So later on, we think it is not possible to extrude it from the radial root, so we have a big sheet in the right femoral root, and through that root, we enter any uh, other catheter and took a CTO wire so that we enter in the opposite direction of the stand and rewiring it. Ultimately, we succeed to do it. See, very meticulously and very cautiously, we rewired the stand and ultimately we succeed. And uh, then we took another 1.5 balloon and pull it to this, this femoral catheter and ultimately drag it to the femoral root with a bigger sheath. After just being narrowed narrow to the sheath, we again uh, introduce uh, the balloon and drag the wire stand so we can enter it in the, the same thing happened because distal segment was do so hoarsely distorted it was never entering in the, even the tensile sheet even. Then we again open a root in the left femoral sheet and we tried to push it from the opposite direction. In the second slide we see we are pushing with the catheter from the opposite side so that we can introduce in, in the sheet or catheter. Even then we failed. So all, we used all the three routes, bigger sheet, all the available possible techniques. Stent is in our grip, but we have failed to introduce in the sheet. So next time we what it did, we, we make a handmade snare, like this way. Initial plan, that we make a U-loop, and another, with the help of another word, we make it a uh, three-dimensional diamond-shaped snare. So uh, initially, we just introduced the uh, snare, handmade snare, and first attempt, we failed to trap the stand, but in the second attempt, we succeed to trap it, and very carefully and gradually, we pull it toward the sheet. So this is our handmade snare, and diamond snare, and this is the distorted, fragmented, and smashed stand. So this is the uh, final, after excluding the uh, stand with wet, this is the final picture. As we drag it, so we check it again the femoral sheath, whether there is any injury to the femoral artery, but ultimately there was no uh, 
like this, no hemorrhage or dissection like this. So our take home message is coronary stent dislodgement during PCI is a very rare but serious complication. Insulin is about 1.4 into 3.4 percent. Control over the dislodge segment is the most important thing during retrieval. You see throughout our course, the stent was in our um, control but we failed to expel it. Multiple access manipulation is crucial. Uh, as with the multiple access, we can attempt in several techniques. And handmade snare is a very comfortable to use, very cost effective, and an attractive option in this situation. Thank you for patience. Sharing.